Good morning and welcome to the Weekly Blend. My name is Heidi Ellsworth. And I'm Karen Edwards. And we're with Roofer's Coffee Shop and Metal Coffee Shop and Ask a Roofer. <laughs> and we're here to talk about what's happening in roofing and metal and so much more. So Karen, we just had a first time event happen on our site on Roofer's Coffee Shop yesterday and it was so yeah. exciting. We did. We had a homepage takeover. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I thought just, you know, like the big CNN and, you know, ESPN, I I thought only those folks did homepage takeovers, but no. We're right up there with those (laughs) those folks. I tell you, it was our friends at Beacon. So it was a friendly takeover. It wasn't hostile at all. (laughs) We loved it. And they were sharing some amazing technology. They're announcing their Beacon mobile app. And it's the newest power tool in roofing. I love that slogan. Very cool. I do too. Yeah, because it is a tool. It can do so much for your roofing business. So check it out. We are just so thrilled to have them on home ta- uh, homepage takeover and a little bit of a hint, watch, it's going to happen again in the next couple of weeks. So um, <laughs> check your social media, check the pay- homepage of Rupert's Coffee Shop every day because you just never know what might happen. We just finished our trends report, which will be available when this weekly blend comes out. One of the things they were talking about, Karen, is that a lot of the contractors are still using phones to talk with their dist- distribution, but um, distribution software, like the mobile app that Beacon is doing, is climbing up every year. We're seeing it get more and more and more. So it is definitely the future. It is. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's nothing like a phone conversation every once in a while, but you know, if the person doesn't answer, if they're busy, you can't get a hold of them. It's really nice to have an app. You can just open it up and do what you need there. Yeah. It was really cool. And Coincidentally, the trends report and the trend survey was sponsored by Beacon. And um, so it was really interesting to see we had um, our, the numbers were much higher of uh, people who own their business who were actually participating in the survey. And the other one that was really interesting, too, is our numbers went up substantially from past years on how many people belong to an association, a trade association. So that's growing, too. That's great to see because associations are such good resources. And I think, you know, when, when people, when, when the pandemic happened and nobody knew what was going on, the associations were there with resources, with information, with help um, for contractors. And I think that that really demonstrated the value of belonging to your association. Yeah, so much. We love our association. So you're going to be able to see all this. We are actually, it will actually, once you see this weekly blend, it will be on demand. But our coffee conversations this week is the release of that trends report. So we Mm -hmm. have some great contractors. We have Joe Hoffman with Hoffman Weber. We have Sherry Miles with Miles Roofing. And we have Tim Brown with Utah Gutters and Exteriors, who are going to be talking with me about the results of that trends report. So be sure to check that out on demand. Hopefully, um, by the time you see this, you actually were on that coffee conversation and already (laughs) heard all of it. (laughs) (laughs) I love it. Um, So Karen... Another campaign that we have every week that's always out there is Answer Me This. And it's all about getting the voice of the contractors and the voice of the roofing industry. It's brought to you by um, Construction Solutions, which is part of Jill Bralter Building Accessories. And you kind of have really been highlighting some of the winners because everybody can win with Answer Me This. Yeah, we have been. Um, So every other week, there's a new question. So about twice a month. And then there's a winner. Um, Just answer the question. And it's a random drawing. And because we love that industry is all about people. And we love learning about other people. So we we like to highlight those winners. And we've got um, uh, an article in our newsroom spotlighting a recent winner, Fred Grennan. We always share, how did you get into roofing? What do you like about Roofer's Coffee Shop? You know, it's just meeting the people. But we also want to show that we actually have winners. People win. (laughs) And um, we do give away prizes. So you always want to be on the lookout and check out our um, promotions and rebates pages and, and see what's out there surveys. There's a survey going on right now that you should all do. And it um, you're getting $50 of classified credit. Um, and also, I think we're going to be pushing out some mugs for that some too. Mugs. So yeah, like, we'll put a link for that. Um, yeah. Links for that in the week in roofing this week. Yeah. Um, and then we'll be sending out another email real soon to um, let you guys participate in that. So know that you get your gifts and there's winners. That's all. Yes. Right. Yes. 
double G um, construction is looking for sales reps out of Florida, mm -hmm. right at the top of the classified. So if you're looking to help in Florida, looking to, um, you know, get out of the cold and spend the winter down there working oh, there. Yeah. They need so much help down there. So yeah, if you, you want to go to some warmer weather and, and help rebuild, um, yeah. check out our classifieds. It's very good. Um, also, I always have to say TPO, EPDM membranes. Are <laughs> it's on our website. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love that stuff. Um, okay, so next week we have a really cool RLW, a different one. It's going to be all about chimneys. Yes. People don't always think about the chimneys, but they're sticking out through the roof, right? Yeah. So you know, roofing contractors need to know how to take care of them, how to maintain them, how to properly make sure they're flashed properly and that there are no leaks. Yeah. Um, so and this one's going to be all about chimneys. Yeah, the restoration of the brick and the mortar is so important. And so it's from our friends at Sashco who really know about that and have the products to help that. But um, what's really fun is Wendy Marvin with Matrix Roofing that you all know, she has a full program on chimney maintenance for homeowners. And they, year after year, they're helping homeowners check their chimney, make sure everything is looking good, all the flashings. And she's going to be on that RLW too, talking about how she does that. So I, I, it, it's a, you don't want to miss this one. It's going to be good. Yeah. November 2nd. It's going to be an hour earlier um, than usual. It's going to be at 10 o'clock Pacific, 1 o'clock Eastern. So um, be sure to register and it, it's going to be great. Uh, finally, I do want to say, Karen, we have been doing a lot of podcasts. Yes. And you can hear and learn so much from the Roofing Road Trips podcast. And we just launched Stories from the Roof again. Yeah. So lots of good information out there and learning opportunities. Yeah. Same thing with YouTube. As always, ring the bell. Go see us out there. We were just looking at it this morning. There's lots of views. So I know. Yeah. Check yeah. it out. Popular <laughs> content. <laughs> well, I'm Karen. I think that's it for this week. Um, lots of great stuff. And we'll be back next week. Um, I'm going to be actually on the road. So we'll be bringing the weekly blend from you on a road trip one more time. <laughs> see ya. Bye.